So hi guys, let's come to a very practical lab question here. First question on the screen. So this was the question. This is actually a Wintrobe's tube. Remember, Wintrobe's tube is about 11 centimeters long, but the numbering is done only in the first uh, one to 10 centimeter, and the numbering is done from both the sides, from top to bottom and from down to up. Okay, why this is so? Because it has to see the fall of erythrocytes, that is erythrocyte sedimentation rate at the end of one hour. Also, we can use it to centrifuge the blood. When we centrifuge the blood three layers are formed rbc buffy coat and the topmost plasma so what do you see you just see the concentration of packed cells that is called as packed cell volume okay so this can be done only in ventrobes tube okay because it's numbered from both the same, both ends so you can easily see both the values in contrast look at the second tube here So guys, this tube is a vestigrin pipette because it's open from both the ends, remember. Now this is a 30 centimeter long tube, but the numbering is only till 0 to 20 centimeters and it is numbered only from one end. So that is why it is only used to estimate ESR, okay. Remember the anticoagulant that we use for Wintrobe is EDTA and for Vestagrin is 3.8% trisodium citrate. Look at this chart. 